Hi, I'm Janet. I'm a personal trainer and massage therapist for Metamorphosis. And today I'm going to be talking with you about what types of shoes to wear to exercise class. So there are lots of different types of exercise classes. And there's two basic rules you can follow to make it really easy to figure out what type of shoe to wear. If the exercise class that you're going to be in is an impact exercise class, then you want a shoe similar to this one, which I would call a cross trainer. It's got a lot of cushion to it. It's also going to have quite a bit of support. It's going to be a heavier shoe because of that. But if your body is leaving the ground and then coming back down, you need something to absorb that impact. It's also important that you have a sole on the bottom of your shoe that's going to make it so that you are not slipping on the different types of flooring that they have in exercise classes. You want something with a lot of grip to it. Your second option would be a shoe that doesn't have a lot of cushioning to it. And this would be a shoe that you would want to wear in a class that isn't going to have any impact. So you're not jumping, your body's not leaving the floor, maybe something like a step class or some type of martial arts combined with weight training. A shoe like that, what you're going to get the advantage of not having the cushion is that the shoe is going to be a lot lighter, so it's not going to add any weight to your body. Again, you still want a shoe that has a sole that's going to have a lot of grip to it so that you're not slipping on the floor. And then I'm going to show you a third option of this unusual looking shoe, which you might have seen people wearing. It's called a five finger shoe. And this shoe is meant to emulate you being barefoot, but it also gives you a sole on the bottom of your foot so that you don't hurt your feet. These shoes are extremely comfortable and depending on your body, they can be worn for either impact or no impact. And they will also have a sole on them that will give you some really great grip. This particular company will give you a choice of the type of sole that you want on the bottom of your shoe just depending on what you're going to be using them for. This one is a hiking version, so I've got a lot of really great nubby pieces on the bottom of this shoe to make it have a lot of grip over rocks and not slipping on sand, and they're also able to get wet. So those are two options for exercise shoes for classes that you may be wanting to take, whether it's an impact class or a non-impact class. And there's a third option for a shoe, if it works well for your body, could do everything for you. I'm Janet, I'm a personal trainer with Metamorphosis, and thanks for watching.